so for instance one time ordering outside one time carrying your water in a plastic bottle sure. while you're working out how much plastic is our body absorbing if we just go with a bare minimum standard and this is just so people know sure. what's happening to their body at the end of the week on an average i would say if you've stored let's say a 1 liter bottle and that is plastic per liter you can expect to consume a quarter million nano plastic pieces so if you've consumed 2 liters of water half a million nano plastics in your gut today itself right and you multiply that it can become worse if you are heating food or adding hot water or or using uh, the same bottle over and over again so which means the wear and tear and the damage which is not you know visible to the naked eye is actually leaching more chemicals and plastics the weekly ingestion the global estimate is that you are ingesting about 5 grams per week of plastic that is the weight of a credit card so you're ingesting on an average a credit card every week right you very rightly put it that if we just start doing two or three things one avoid plastic tiffin boxes whether in school whether in office second don't heat you know food which you received via a delivery you know from a restaurant anywhere don't heat it in that same plastic container quickly remove it from it and use your metal containers even though there are microwave safe plastics it doesn't mean they are not leaching the chemicals or the microplastics into the food mm. the third part and again for school children you know the long term impact is way more grave because the exposure is so early in their life so the impact on metabolism on cardiovascular risk and more importantly cognitive function I love what you said at the beginning of the interview that we can either wait for 20 or 30 years and when the research is finally out we can say oh my god we you know really subjected ourselves to this horrible mess yeah or we can open our eyes right now and say this is not mm-hmm. something biological it's not natural it doesn't need to be in my body